Hello, hello. Welcome to my channel. This is your girl Morgan of I'm Morgan Ashley. We talk a little bit about everything over here from reviews, hauls, vlogs, whatever it is. I'm going to talk about it here. If you're a returning supporter, thank you so much for the continued support, y'all. I appreciate y'all. And if you are new here, I ask that you watch this video to the end. Check out some of my other content. And if you are enjoying the videos that you are seeing, why not just subscribe? if we vibe in but i do ask that you do not leave this channel without subscribing because it really helps your girl out um but as we saw in today's title we are getting back to the basics um your girl has lost 50 pounds if you watched previous videos y'all know that um but i really had to start from ground zero nothing in my closet fit everything was too big and i'm not happy if i ain't got clothes so i had to do it smart i had to do it where it was affordable and the best way to do that was find basic pieces that i can mix and match and i can wear with every and anything and then build my wardrobe around that so that's what we're going to be talking about in today's video. I'm going to be showcasing the basics that I found and you know where I started from when rebuilding my closet. I hope you guys enjoy this video. It is a different format for me. I'm hoping you can hear me clearly but if not I do apologize and I'll just get better and improve. But without further ado let's jump into today's video. So first off, our sets. I only technically have one set, but I do have it in um, multiple in multiple colors. Uh, the first up is white, and I decided to dress this option up a little bit more. This nice knit pant set is from Zara. I will link it below if it's still available, but I love it. I definitely added this to my closet when I was first starting to get back into shopping, just because I felt like it was very versatile, um, and it's. A little bit of more oomph when it comes to a set I, again I dressed it up and I definitely feel like this is a great set you can dress down you'll see in the next look but can we get a moment for the top off the shoulder so good um, and then I feel like again when losing weight that's why I'm trying to rebuild my wardrobe but I still have those problem areas that I'm still could be self-conscious about and that includes like my fupa or my stomach area but the ruching detailing in this top definitely hides that or conceals that that's why I definitely feel like these types of tops when they have ruching detail are great for people you're like me who are very self-conscious or trying to hide or conceal your stomach area or your problem Problem area and then the pants are a great length for my tall, tall girls or if you are like me I'm 5'5 five five, but I can wear these pants with heels or I can wear them with flats it's a great quality knit you have to be very conscious especially when shopping in Zara because their knits can be a little cheap sometimes but this is not one of those this is a nice quality knit that you can wash multiple times and it will not start to beat up or anything like that it's also a knit that's very it's thick but not too thick it still gives you enough breathing room so I'm in Houston the humidity is crazy now I probably would never wear this out during the daytime but I definitely would wear this to dinner or some event or somewhere when the sun goes down but I love this set I had to have it it is so good again i love the detailing in the shirt with the off the shoulder and the ruching in the stomach i don't have and never had anything like this i feel like it's just very very special and also for the details of how i paired it um, the earrings are from asos the bag is balenciaga and my shoes are Bottega. again i will try to link everything as far as when it comes to accessories or just things i paired it with in the description box below and like i said if you like something buy it in every color and this set was too good that i cannot pass up in the black version as well i don't think i mentioned in the white version but both sets black and white top and bottom they are larges and i will say however if this set is still available again it will be linked below if it is uh, that the black top runs a little bit tighter to me than the white version so just fyi but again the reason why i really love sets I've been trying to curate my closet and bring in pieces. Uh, six per se is 
because they're so versatile. And of course, when you stick to neutrals like me, you can wear them with everything. Um, here in the black set, you see I paired it in a way more casual way than I did in the white, and it's still very cute. It's not overly, like, why she got sneakers on with that set? You would never know. And I think the knit definitely helps that. Um, even with the off the shoulder, I still feel like you can get away with wearing sneakers. And how I paired this, um, these are old gold hoops, um, my Coach Wavy Dinky bag, and then some Adidas Samba sneakers. Um, and I will say that the pants do have an elastic band, so you can be very cognizant if you are like me and are still trying to lose additional pounds, or if you, yo, you can grow with these if your weight goes up or if it goes down. This is a great piece to have and that's exactly why I had to get a knit set in my closet when I'm trying to start my closet over just because I know me. As much as I wanna lose this weight, it can come right back and I don't wanna to have to start buying clothes all over again. So I really love this set. It is so super cute. I definitely would recommend it if it is still available. Next we're gonna move into dresses. Again, this is another dress that if I loved it, I had to buy it multiple times. This time, times three. Um, starting off with this white version. So this cute number is from H&M and when I saw it, I fell in love with it. And when I say the price point was amazing, this dress I believe was only either $9.99 or like $12.99. I had to have it, especially in every color. And the reason why I love this dress is again, it's another great basic to start building your wardrobe around because it is so versatile. When I say you can dress this up, you can dress this down and the material is so good. It's such a light, weight material a dress where it's casual but at the same time not too casual so instead of thinking like oh i can't wear this to say brunch you really can the material is just that great and it looks so great in person it has like a slick feel to it i paired it with my green bottega bag and these fun green nike sneakers that have this yellow in the nike check but I love this dress. And again, I'm all about concealing those problem areas for me. So the way this dress silhouette is set up is super cute and flattering, I believe. Um, of course it's tight, but at the same time, since the bottom flares out a little bit, it allows for the ruching um, to happen here in the stomach again, like the set, which conceals the pooch or the fupa or whatever you want to call it so you can play around with it and move it how you would like but it's a great effect to try to conceal that problem area if you have it and i also feel like this dress was very reminiscent of a tennis skirt or not a tennis skirt or a tennis a tennis dress per se and we definitely know that those are in at the moment especially pleated tennis skirts now it doesn't have pleats and it's not a skirt, but to me, it still gives me that, that fun, cool tennis vibe. So I had to pick it up. I love it so much. I literally throw this on to run errands or going to brunch because again, it's that versatile and you can build an outfit around this. If you want to put a cardigan or a jean jacket around it, you can definitely do that. Um, it's a great basic to have. So again, something else that you just need to have in your closet are dresses. Same dress, different color. Like I said, I purchased this in multiple colors times three. This is this beautiful camel color and I love this color as well. This dress came in a wide array of colors and I don't think they were all available on the app. If I didn't mention this dress is from H&M, I have it in a size. I picked it up in a size large and this is how it fits me just because I didn't do a 360 in the white version but this is a size large and the reason why I didn't want to go to a medium which I felt like I no I don't think I could have <laughs> but again I didn't want it to be too tight I know I knew that I was buying this dress for more of a casual look um, and just to be comfortable in and this is definitely one of those dresses where it's fun, breathable, you can move in those hot, almost hot summer days. And the way I dress this one up, as you can see, compared to the sneakers, I paired it with a cute form sandal to elevate it a little bit more than a regular sneaker. These are my Gucci denim sandals and 
my Loewe puzzle bag in orange just to do a pop of color. I love the way this one looks as well. I think these dresses are super cute and I definitely think you can wear them into the office depending if they're not too short uh, and how your booty is because they could go a little bit short if you have a larger bottom than I do. But I definitely feel like you can pair this with a cardigan as well and wear this into the office. Now I probably won't just because I'm thicker thighed and I'm just a little weird like that. But again, the versatility when I was buying pieces such as these dresses is what I needed. And the ability to wear them with sneakers, pair them with some platforms, or wear them into the office if I felt comfortable, I could do that with these. And again, these neutral tones where, can, where you can easily wear them in any months depending on where you are located. So like I'm in Houston, it's typically hot throughout the year. So I definitely could get away with wearing this dress throughout the year. Um, of course, not in those cooler months, cold fronts, but this is a dress that you can definitely, again, wear up, wear down. Uh, I think you could possibly wear this with heels. I probably would never pair this dress with heels, but it's definitely an option if you feel like you can get away with that and pair it. I think the right person can do that. It's just not my style to pair with. Um, heels but I definitely love this dress and would recommend it again I got pooch and I wanted to add to that I definitely feel like it would you can see my pooch but I do not have on any slimming undergarments so I definitely feel like if you are a little hesitant to buy this dress or has or navigate navigate towards a material like this where it is a little bit more form-fitting and even if you feel like the ruching is not going to conceal your problem area if it's a stomach you can definitely get away with wearing um, compression or like banks or something under this dress and you won't see it just because the bottom again of the dress is flared so you won't see that line on your thigh or anything like that or if you wear a panty version of that so you can definitely pair it with this dress and it definitely would conceal that stomach area area a fupa or whatever and of course you still have the ruching in the stomach area to do that as well to hide and do what it need to do last but not least the color that has gotten the most wear is of course black it is not me if i don't pick up something in black black is my go-to it always will be no matter how big or how small i am but black is just so good all the time but we see this color version i definitely pretty it casual as well but i um, just love the black but anyways i feel like this is a super cute look that you can wear to the airport as well the dress is that comfortable where if you're spending eight hours on a plane you will be comfortable you may be cold so bring a blanket but it's definitely great and enough breathable and um, you have enough move to move in but this is the black version. I paired it with my gold Nike sneakers. I forgot the name, they're linked below. And of course I had to do an honorable mention of this, which is also a new pickup and something that I wanted to add to my closet just because I am a denim jacket girl. Now we are in the wrong season for it, but you gotta go pick it up if it's still available. I'm sure it is, but you gotta buy your fall pieces in the summer. <laughs> Levi denim jacket. I got this off the Levi website. Now, when it comes to the video, this is basics, affordability, building your wardrobe. I think, believe this denim jacket was 145, so it is a little bit pricey for a denim jacket, but to me, the detailing, if you are a girl who loves denim jackets like me, it's investment and Levi's denim quality. You will have this for a lifetime. Most of my denim jackets were, of course, getting too big and I just was not loving the fit of them on me. Uh, and of course, you can wear denim jackets uh, oversized, but I just was not loving the fit of mine now, especially losing the weight. So I had to pick this up. I kept getting an ad on Instagram showing me this denim jacket and I did not want to pull the trigger on it, but I had to. It's so good. It is a men's. I'm wearing it in a size medium, but I just love the detailing with the Levi's patches, the different color tones of denim, the strips of denim. Um, I will roll down the sleeve so you can see it, but the detailing on this is just super, super good. Uh, hello, just show the back of it. This is it, but it's super cute and I love it. So I had to do an honorable mention of outerwear per se when you're building your wardrobe, having great pieces like this, a denim jacket that you can definitely wear all year round. Well, not the summer per se, but it's one of those pieces that is like, did you make that? Where did you get that? 
these are one of those so definitely go get this Levi's denim jacket and these dresses which I'm in love and our next category is really going to be like two in one it's going to be denim jeans and tank tops per se we'll see the different styles of jeans and tank tops but of course to me what is not a wardrobe of basics without denim jeans and tank tops like, you gotta have them and for me I was out growing or you, you know shrinking in size when it came to my denim so all of my denim was way too big and when i say i had bought so many pairs of denim um when i was heavier that nothing was fitting i was depressed because it's like i can't even wear jeans oh so i definitely went heavy in the jean department and it may be a little bit too hot for that but i definitely wanted to share this piece just because i feel like denim jeans are foundational to any wardrobe um, you're thinking about most pieces to just wear being having a thoughtful thoughtful wardrobe an impactful wardrobe really you gotta have good denim um, and i don't care regardless of the summer spring fall winter you can wear jeans all year long you might be hot but you can wear them uh, but first up uh, with these denim jeans these are from american eagle if you follow me on my socials instagram and tiktok at i'm morgan ashley you should have seen these i definitely did a outfit of the day look with these previously but these are super good again another ad that i was served on instagram i kept seeing these jeans and i had to have them they're in a size 14 i don't believe they're available anymore but if they are they will be linked below and then also when i'm talking about those literally basic pieces tank tops you can do tank tops casual dress it up dress it down tank tops to me are the most versatile piece in a wardrobe and the best and the most important thing it is when it comes to tank tops is the quality so you'll see in the tank tops that i'll show you just how the denim jeans switch up different styles washes fits the same thing with the tank tops you'll see that they're different styles colors instead of just being like oh that's a regular tank top um, but this tank top is from zara and you can see it is a little special it's not a regular tank top um, we love a cropped moment um, but it has these strings on them and it has this cute little detailing i'll get a little bit closer um but they have these little hooks on them so you can see it's a ribbed top crop top with that special detailing and it just makes the simple outfit just look a little extra because it's like oh girl where you get that crop tank top from you gotta have these cute tank tops to make an elevated outfit a simple denim jean and the same thing with these denim jeans going back to them the cuts and the these we love a distressed denim the heavy cuffs we knew we know uh, cuffs were definitely in this past season i don't anticipate them going anywhere uh, my favorite uh, big cuff jeans are mesa margella mm6 jeans i can't find them anywhere in my size but i love them but these will have to do at american eagle but i love these um and how i paired it um, these Bottega dupe earrings from Amazon. This is probably like 20 years old. I think this is from like ever 21 back in the day. This is a Tasha bag. Tasha, I believe is how you pronounce the brand. It was a collaboration with Simplicity X Style, right? Shaniqua on Instagram, you gotta follow her. She is that icon, style icon. In my eyes, that girl can dress her ass off. She got the pieces for days. So if you're not following her, go follow her. I love her. She from New York, I believe Brooklyn. So yeah, Learned this was a collaboration like I said that she did like two years ago. So I don't believe this is available anymore. Um, and these cute should sandals um, that are the same color um, of the bag. And I just thought this was super cute. Again, another very casual outfit that elevated, but these are basics. And the best way to dress up and elevate any basic pieces are to get those basics that are special. We see that in this tank top, we see that in these denim jeans, but we also see it with our accessories. So again, another pair of denim jeans, another tank top. We do not have to make rebuilding our wardrobe or finding those basic essential pieces hard. It's really that simple. These denim jeans are Levi's. These are their 724. I believe they're straight 
cut boot cut straight jeans um in this dark wash you have to be very versatile or have a ride a wide array of different washes and styles when it comes to denim how the previous pair we were distressed wide cuff they were more of a baggy boyfriend cut where these are you know straight boot cut jeans they're very flattering if you want to give a different vibe off um again, another pair of denim jeans you gotta have a dark wash you just gotta have a simple dark denim wash it is essential when it comes to a wardrobe um this tank top this is from target y'all it's a simple tank top but it is great quality these i believe were eight dollars i believe they're on sale right now for like 650 so go pick them up but i grabbed these in every single color that they had my size i'm wearing it in a size medium but i love these type of tank tops from anywhere and target just so happened to have them um great quality you can wear them a wide array. If you're very stylish, you can make this a crop top. Get you a ponytail holder, tie it in the front, make it more flatted, tie it in the back. A wide array of ways you can wear a simple tank top. Like, press this one up with heels, and I think this is fine. Super cute, super casual. Your basics do not have to be overcomplicated. They don't have to be expensive in order to look good okay and i also pair them with another honorable mention these super cute shoes are from steve madden's these are actually a dupe of some christian louboutins um bali shoes i believe but these are steve madden hmm i forgot the name but they'll be linked below but i have these in three colors as well again I'm not trying to build up my shoes like it'll fit my shoes but when I love something and it's a great basic and versatile and I can wear with every and anything from dresses to denim like this I had to have them and they're very comfortable shoes so I have these in pink I have them in black I have them in clear I'll leave inserts on the screen of these shoes and then i'll also be sure to leave inserts on the screen of all the wide array of colors that i have in this tank top but these tank tops are super super good um denims are super super good i definitely feel like levi does a great job when it comes to thicker women um room and being able to have denim that is stretched but not look like jeggings still gives you that jean feel and look they know i mentioned the affordability and the price point of these tank tops but also like i said tank tops you have to get a wide range of different styles and cuts when it comes to tank tops this is a long one in the previous one with the zara white cropped it was cropped and it had the string so you gave it a more elevated crop top but a simple tank top like this still can work in anyone's wardrobe you can get great quality tank tops at any price point like i said this is from target it was eight dollars you can't beat it i'm just saying also to get a little closer just to show you the quality of the tank top it is a ribbed material but it's super good stretch um material where i feel like you can definitely have this for the summer when you can get a couple washes out of it I um, always recommend buying multiple white versions just because I hate when white gets dingy. So I bought this tank top in two or three whites. Um, have multiple colors as you guys saw on the screen. Summer wouldn't be summer. Gotta have the all white pair. Um, these are Levi denim jeans again. These are 726 flare jeans. Um, tank top is actually from Macy's. It's from their line on 34th. But I've actually wore this outfit before back in may i wore it to a frank beverly in may's concert their farewell tour um i think it just eats or it's not eat. it's very simple and basic but again these simple basic pieces can make and elevate an outfit y'all it's also with the accessories like i mentioned before this bag um britney of pocket and bows actually share this so i picked this up this is from anthropology when it was on sale and then i paired it with my super cute fendi sequence shoes which i love um yeah i have the different styles and cuts when it comes to denim in your wardrobe when we're thinking about 
you can't just buy denim to buy it. You might think it's cute, but you have to be thoughtful. We saw our distress pair with our cuffs. Then we saw our straight dark wash, simple jeans. And now we have a flared look in white denim. You have to have white denim in the summer. It is mandatory. And pairing it again with a simple tank top. Like, you can't tell me somebody that this outfit was under $100 because yes, we got both pieces from Macy's and on sale at that. Um, well, when it comes to the top and the bottom, the accessories are a different story, but you know what I mean? Like getting simple pieces that are nice. And again, this tank top from Macy's is this very nice material. It's ribbed, it's ribbed as well, but the material is a lot smoother and softer. It has that buttery feel compared to say the tank top that I previously had on from Target. Um, you just have to get very different styles and feels when it comes to these tank tops in your wardrobe so you can wear them very casually or you can wear them to a nice concert and not feel like I don't have anything special or I'm just basic. No girl you gonna look good regardless you put it on you gonna feel good. But I love this outfit again simple jeans simple tank top and it eats. I wanted to add that I do have these denim jeans and another wash and I'm telling y'all when it comes to rebuilding your wardrobe your closet you have to get multiple styles colors washes y'all saw I have distressed I have boot cut I have straight I got flare which way you can definitely do it without breaking the bank if you made it here thank you so much because we are at the end this is our final outfit our final pieces um starting off with these denim jeans these are super cute they are from target um the bag is from ndg this tank top is from zara and then again our good old faithful seed madden shoes in a different colorway and this is what i'm telling y'all get basic pieces but you just have to get different styles and arrays and you got outfits for days. I don't know how many pairs of jeans I've showed you. I don't know how many different tank tops, crop top styles I've shown you, colors, like the dresses, the sets. Y'all have endless outfits. Y'all are set for the summer. I just need to incorporate some more denim shorts and I'll be good. I don't need to buy any other thing. I mean, of course I will, it's me. But when I'm telling you guys, you can really rebuild your wardrobe, you can rebuild your closet. Look at me, I dropped 50 pounds and to me, I'm, I'm set for the summer. Um, these basic pieces are, yes, basics, but I was able to you know, start rebuilding my wardrobe with these basic pieces at an affordable price point. You just have to be mindful where you're getting your basics from, Zara, H&M, Target. Yes, sometimes they have not so great quality, but you just have to be mindful when you're picking out the pieces to get those pieces that are great quality and you can mix and match with everything. This Zara tank top, they usually come out every summer and I usually rebuy every summer, but it's great quality as well. Um, I have it in white, I have it in black, and we paired it with these jeans that have this nice sheen of silver to them. Like I said, for denim, you have to buy different fits colors, washes, everything. Um, you don't wanna just get the same style in every type of denim. Denim can elevate simple tank tops like this. Um, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure you leave a comment below or like the video, share the video. And most importantly, if you are not subscribed to my channel, please make sure you go do so before you leave my channel. If you wanna go check out some other videos, please go feel free to do so. But I ask that you please subscribe. I hope you guys loved it as much as I enjoyed filming this and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Drought and famine, natural disaster.